Lee <clears throat> that she had for quite a few years, he uh, sold it. Gone. Well, it's not gone yet, but he's delivering it to the guy soon here, so. No more rides on the Jubilee, I guess, but anyways, that's all right. Good little tractor, though, just fired right up. Look how many hours. Well, the new proof feeder, <laughs> it's got a lot more hours than that on it, but. Yeah, solder, gone. Anyways, uh, we gotta deliver it to him. It's just not too far from, from my house here, so. Yeah, it's too bad. It's a good little tractor, but it's got that Massey Ferguson 135 with the power steering now, right? So, but uh, yeah, this is a good little tractor too. It still steers pretty good. It's just a little bit harder for him now. So, but anyways, just thought I'd share that with you. The old Jubilee's going to a new home. And uh, I'm not usually a racist kind of person, but <laughs> this guy was, uh, let's say, not from here. Not being racist or nothing, but I know these guys are animals, and this thing is going to get destroyed, unfortunately. It's going to get destroyed. So, anyways, can't do too much about that. It's not my machine, so. The way she goes. He's even that guy was asking how much for it. Well, um, she's already sold. I'm like, oh, she already sold, bud. Sorry. Ah, oh, he says, ah. Oh. But anyway, I would have kept her myself. <laughs> I was, uh, like I say, not to be racist, but when the guy came to the door, I'm like, oh man, you know what he wants to do with it? Put it on his front lawn and just let it sit there. I'm like, oh my God, that'll destroy it in no time. So anyways, I'm a bit uh, perturbed at that and I gotta actually text him. I'm like, how much do you want for it if I buy it right now from you? He's like, didn't get back to me, didn't get back to me, didn't get back to me and he's like, oh man, sorry I didn't see your message. I already just sold it to that guy. I'm like, oh no. But anyways, it needs a bit of cosmetic now. It's getting a little tired too, right? But uh, I mean, it works, so, but anyways. He's got that 135 now, and it's a good little tractor, too. It's, this should be fine. Um, but this one, you know, he rebuilt the... Well, he put new rings in it and stuff. And same pistons, the same sleeves. He just kind of re-ringed it. But anyways, hope you guys don't think I'm racist for saying stuff like that. But it's like... I know how these guys are. They're animals with stuff like this. It'll just... It'll get destroyed, this thing. So, you know, that's a pretty important tractor this one with the uh, anniversary edition right the jubilee was the anniversary edition for ford special tractor came out that year this year so you don't see a whole lot of them that look even this good a shape really anymore but uh anyways there she is she's going down the road i was just sitting here at a checkpoint thought i'd wait for him just make sure he's getting along all right i think that's him coming there i think i can almost hear it zoomed in right now to his mirror so that's why it's not a very good picture but anyways sort of focusing the mirror's kind of dirty but yeah, he's coming i think should have probably just loaded it on the trailer for him i guess we could have done that too but i think he wanted to drive it for one last little tour you know he likes driving that tractor and eh, such a good tractor too right but oh man but uh, anyways, hopefully where she's going, it's going to be treated right. Not just destroyed. Better not be. It's even got the four ways and everything on that thing. You did her up good, that's for sure. Zipping along, eh? <laughs> Pretty awesome. Good little runner. No smoke out of her now. That's good. He did the rings in her and did her a good job. So, anyways, we'll continue on. Yeah. So he had that thing all right apart. He had the uh, well. He had the pistons out, and uh, he didn't re-sleeve it though. He just put new rings in it. I guess they were getting enough that it was letting the oil get past and burning up and it was smoking pretty good and I, I 
Uh, I hate to say it, but I think that's what I'm gonna have to do with my my 800 too. I had another little problem with my 800 the other day when I had her out. I noticed some uh, bubbling coming out of the head gasket area on the on the uh, spark plug side. I'm like, oh, you got to be kidding me. So regardless, it's gonna have to take the hood off again and the tank off to get in there to get the valve cover off to uh, tighten up the, uh, the head gasket or maybe I, I might even uh, take it down further take the head off again take the oil pan off again and pull the pull the pistons out and put a set of rings in it maybe that would help it out I think it kind of needs sleeves too so I might do them I might get that kit well, it's expensive but nice to have it all done up too right and, uh, it's uh, it's it's burning oil for sure this is the 800 I'm referring to which is kind of identical looking to this thing here the Jubilee right same sort of paneling and stuff and sheet work sheet metal work but uh, yeah I noticed it's yeah I mean the other day when I had it out there I'm like wow it's like really needing oil what the heck where did that all go it burns it up I guess so it's not dripping anything which is good but anyways thought I'd share that with you so we might have to be doing that soon on that thing tear it all down again and re-sleeve it and try to get those sleeves out again that I glued back in the ones that were loose so that's not going to be fun but I'm going to have to probably break them and uh, fracture them and get them out but anyways that's I'm not really looking forward to that because that's a big job and I don't really have a really good spot to work on it you know in the container is fine whatever but it's not not ideal so but anyways, uh, yeah, last drive of the tractor, eh? Oh, well, he's got more. He's got another one anyways. Oh, there she is in her new home. That guy's going to kill that thing. Or himself. <laughs> Maybe. I think that's all he wanted it for, just to put it on the front lawn, eh? That's what he said. Oh, boy. Someone's probably going to steal it tonight. <laughs> Luckily. I'm glad we're off. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh boy, he's happy anyways. Alrighty. Well, tractor's delivered. Anyways, we're home. We barely got a couple of kilometers away and he calls. How do you turn off the lights? I'm like, turn the key off. Like I say, I'm not racist. Alright. But there's some people that have come to this country that should not own something like that. That have no idea how to drive. We showed them. He drove it back and forth a little bit, and I'm like, "Okay, let's let's just get out of here. <laughs> this is this is going to be bad." Nice house too, right? You seen this front of his house there? I'm like, "Okay, let's just get out of here. We got the money. Let's run." <laughs> or he got the money. Let's run. Oh man, <laughs> I thought this was going to be a nightmare. He's either going to run himself over with that thing. Like it's not a nice tractor to drive like my John Deere stuff, right? It's different. You got to know what you're doing with these. Ford tractors and stuff with clutches right it's different so I don't know he's got it but he called us like within a couple of kilometers like I say from his house and how do you do this how do you do that I'm like I don't know man he's one of those ones like I said I'm not racist I'm not racist but I can't understand him I just hung up on him honestly tried to help him out show him tell him where the switches are told him that and he's like blah, blah. I'm like sorry dude I can't help you you know we were there we showed you everything that's the way it is. So he'll figure it out, I'm sure. We even gave him the original manual that come with that tractor. So, you know, he'd read that. But anyways, that's it for today. I'm a little upset. A little bit. It's a nice little tractor. That was a good little machine, you know. And uh, like I say, he, uh, he's having trouble driving it. So, you know, I don't blame him for wanting to sell it. And he got that 135 now anyways. And it's got the power steering and about the same sort of thing. Anyways, a little bit bigger actually, so... Should be good, but anyways, that's it. That's all I can say. So you guys have a good one. Thanks again for watching, and we'll catch you all later.